Give it up for him. There's four people in the crowd, Monty. They ain't gonna be able to clap too loud, are they? Damn, I am screaming in this motherfucker already, ain't I? How's everybody doing at the rebar tonight? How's everybody doing at the rebar tonight? I found a guitar pick, suck my dick. I found one, I really did, y'all. How's everybody doing? It's almost Thanksgiving. How's everybody getting their turkeys this year? Is anybody gonna run them over in the motherfucking road and pick them up? That's how we used to do it back home in East Tennessee, you know what I mean? What about them cowboys, man? It makes me bad when my cowboys lose that way, I guess. At least we ain't Houston Oilers getting beat by the shittiest team in the fucking NFL, are we? Right? Right? Houston, oh yeah, Detroit's got Houston beat. I'm sorry, y'all. I didn't know no matter. Y'all know Nike? Nike's come out with a space shoe is what I call it. I call it a space shoe because it's made out of every bit of debris from space debris out in outer space. I thought Chinese kids made the shoes, not aliens. You know what I mean? Thought Nike couldn't get no cheaper? Bet that shit, they just showed you. You know what I mean? Like I bought a pair of Jordans to work in the other day and you talk about some stiff ass fucking shoes. I was like, this motherfucker should have played ball since 84 in these shoes just to loosen them up. You know what I mean? They was, they was leather, but they was nice, so I can't complain. You know what I mean? How many men in here like to wear condoms? Woo! One man, two men likes to wear condoms. How many women likes to have condoms in them? <laughs> hey, we got a supporter out there of the Trojan, anti-Trojan campaign. You know what I mean? But yeah, they, I've seen these commercials now, and it's like Trojan condoms. They've got sizes. The fuck? I never know that. I always know it was a condom and then a motherfucking magnum. Something like condom for shorty, magnum for Monty Hicks. You know what I mean? Like Lies. <laughs> I'm not going to stick my leg in a motherfucking rubber balloon. You know what I mean? Mr. Radiator Hose over here. Women don't like to be stabbed to death, Monty. You thought that was a compliment, didn't you? <laughs> tampons, ladies. How many women use tampons? How many of y'all pigs in here bleed? <laughs> Damn. Oh, I didn't get you's intentions on that? How many people bleed? I mean, I know there's a few of you because I see a couple women looking at me like, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Sorry, ladies, it's all right. But anyway, tampons come out with sizes of tampons now. It's like, when did they come out with fucking tampons that if it's too hard to get in, then you've got to go up a size, or to down a size. And if it slides out, what the fuck you throwing a hot dog down a hallway for? It's like, you should know what size your fucking tampon should be, shouldn't you? And you should never walk in a Revco or a CVS and say, sir, do you know where the medium condoms is? It's like, who the fuck asked that shit? It's like, wrap a glad bag around it with a rubber band and learn how to do it the old school way. Nah, I don't like condoms. That's why I got fucking kids. You know what I mean, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> My son's gonna be 15 come Thursday on Turkey Day, ladies and gentlemen. My 15-year-old. Can I give it up one time for a 15-year-old? He is taller than me, ladies and gentlemen. Thank Jesus Christ. You know what I mean? He's almost six foot. And I'm just gonna tell you this, because I was... He comes to stay with me about six, seven months ago for a couple of days, him and his little brother. And I was like, he's sitting in the living room and he's like, Daddy, give me a towel. So I go in there, because it's my kid. I'm not thinking about it. I've wiped his ass before. I mean, I've seen his little bitty cock. I'm not thinking nothing about it. I hand him that towel and I'm like, holy shit. I'm like, the fuck is that? Is that yours or did you hide? What'd you do, steal that? He's like, no, what are you talking about? I'm like, God damn, you must be the milkman jungin'. I was like, you ain't even my kid with that cock on you. I was like, I mean, son, I'm telling you, I'm proud of my youngin' no matter who he is, because when he pulls down his pants, he's better than you are. You know what I mean? You gotta make your kids happy and always tell them that they're good, no matter if they're bad. Tell them they're good, I got good kids, though. How many people likes Joe Biden in the room? Ain't no Joe Biden supporters in here. Well, how the fuck's he in office? Let's, that's right, Brandon Shorty Rice. Let's go, Brandon. First off, I want to know where we're going. Second of all, do you have any drugs? 
And third of all, you're not sticking nothing in my ass. You know what I mean? But yeah, Joe Biden's more fucking confused than Bruce Jenner's gynecologist is. You know what I mean? It's like, do I stick my finger in it? Do I jerk it off? What do I do with it? It's like Shorty's gonna start shitting in the women's bathroom. You know what I mean? One, because I don't want to smell it out of men's ass. And two, when a woman farts, it sounds cute, don't it? I don't want to hear y'all fucking blowing up toilets like goddamn Vietnam, you know what I mean? <laughs> Fuck that shit. But no, Joe Biden, y'all, like I heard he was in the hospital on Friday night, I believe. And I'm sitting here thinking of colon cancer just waiting to take you, son of a bitch, at any time. You know what I mean? Like, how do you put a man that's not even going to make it through four years in the fucking White House? I don't want to see a president die. I wasn't around when John Kennedy got shot in the back of the fucking head, you know what I mean? Imagine that fucking ride, you know what I mean? Imagine me and his wife sitting beside him and all of a sudden head go up like he's fucking eating her pussy. Do you think she grabbed his hair and put it on her head? You know what I mean? Do you think that's what happened? Ladies and gentlemen, it's the rebar damn. I'm the first one up. Give up better fucking applause for the next one up. Brandon Shorty Rice, if you like me, if you don't suck my dick, Monty Hicks is already on stage, so here you go.